Now to turn off your car, all you have to do is just press this. And once you press this, that's it. You're done. It's just automatically gonna turn off later. I'm gonna show you right here, there's a mirror on the other side for passenger, also a mirror, close that up. Now from the front, if I look to the back, that's how it looks like. Oh, and I forgot to show you guys in the middle. So this is the middle seat of the front. If you lift this up, there's some additional storage. So that's actually extremely useful. And of course, I also forgot the front. Yeah, you've got USB and right here, you got your standard connection right in there. Would also like to note that don't mind these, these are nothing. That's if you ordered more stuff to come with your car, then there would be something there or there or there. And there would be something here as well. That's if you customize your car and got a better model or you just added stuff to your car. So again, this was a view from the passenger side. Now the cameras will be located right here. You will notice these. And on the back, you're gonna notice this as well. If you got the trailer in your package, you will get these connections. Plus you're also gonna get the hitch. So that's how the hitch looks like from the trailering package. So to unlock it, you press twice, it unlocks. And we can just go ahead and manually push it down. And it goes down really, really easily. It's got the assist. Now right here, it looks really dark. That's because we got the cover on it, but you're gonna notice that we did add a spray to it as well. So again, the, the spray is pretty important. That's, some, that's a must really. And that's how the spray looks like. It's not gonna be the most pretty thing in the world, but it is to protect your car and you will need it. Most people will need it. But anyways, let's just put this up, let's put it up. All you have to do is just push it up and then it just locks. So if I open this up, this is where your gas goes. You can see some instructions there. Let's just close this up. So again, this is how the trifold looks like. It's a pretty neat one. And again, we got this straight from them. Just gonna highlight the step a little bit because it is something that looks really good and it is useful if you're maybe around five foot. This would be useful for this type of truck. We'd also like to note that the handbrake is actually this button right here. So if you are parking on something steep, go ahead and use that. So that's right here on your driver's side. It would be on the left-hand side, just beside these guys, but underneath these guys. Now to open up the hood of this Chevy, down here below, just below this button, you will notice this down here. All you have to do is just go like so. You're gonna hear a pop. You're gonna notice that this just opened up. All you have to do is just put your hand in. You're gonna feel something that you have to press, well, kind of swivel to the right-hand side, and that unlocks it. So what I was, talking about is this and I was just pressing this like so so I was doing this action to unlock this and that actually makes this unlock like so so that's what that does all right so the engine and everything else you guys can have a quick glance at it so here you go so it's pretty easy to access right here a battery which is very important so I've seen some models of cars where it's almost impossible which makes absolutely no sense and really there's not that much to show you but here you go and to close this you just bring it down so i do want to note that you do have to kind of slam this in order to lock it up or else you're just gonna be pushing up and down a lot now here is the back of the truck and that's it. There's really not much more to show you. That would be it for this video. If, if you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you.